Hi guys and welcome to How Much Bitcoin YouTube channel. Today we're gonna check out Tupac USB miner, not the singer. <laughs> this thing can mine Bitcoin and Bitcoin Cash and it has performance of 15 giga hashes. It actually can do a little more if you overclock it. But before we start, today's video is sponsored by Polymath. Polymath is a new platform that creates possibilities of securities and stock exchange market going into the cryptocurrency world. Polymath provides a platform where people can exchange and create new tokens that are based on everyday trading with dividend and other options just like a stock market in the New York exchange. Polymath might be the biggest invention since Ethereum since it really embeds the real world stock market with the crypto world. Check out their platform at polymath.network. So this little guy, I found it out of Amazon. It's pretty cheap and it actually has um, everything built in. So power supply, uh, all the controlling chips, it's all already in there. And the two mining chips are right here. Those mining chips are from the Antminer. Uh, Bitmain company those two chips in there. I think it's from the s7 the Antminer s7 So there's two chips in there and it takes about three watts or less. This is so small It's less than an LED bulb So I don't know if we can actually calculate how much money will cost you to run it, you know, maybe cents per month so you know, it's basically practically free to run and It actually makes a profit so after checking the calculation online using a Bitcoin mining calculator, I found out that on Bitcoin Cash, it actually makes a dollar and 10 cents per month. So if you're running this 24 seven on any computer, you can just plug it in. You plug it into any computer and then you can just run it and that's it. All you have to do to run this device is download CG Miner, change the user ID to yours and the correct pool URL. And after that, all the mining performance hashing power will go to your account so you get paid. I'll show you guys how to do this right now. In order to make the miner work for you, the first thing you have to do is to download the CG miner. You can just Google CG miner and find the software and download it. Once it's downloaded, you're going to go to slush pool and you're going to create a username, your own username and worker ID. Then after you have that, you open the software and you'll be able to change the .bat file to specifically the slush pool address and the user ID and the sub user. So that's basically the worker name. Once that's done, you can set up the frequency. I do 140. 150 is the standard by manufacturer. 140 is a bit lower because it's so hot. So I decided to put a little lower. If it's running too hot, definitely put it lower. If you have a really cool environment, you can overclock it and put it a little higher. Then you get a little higher hash rate. Once this is done, all we have to do now is start the software and plug in the USB. As you can see here, that little number says here, uh, it says 16 giga hashes and 19 giga hashes. It will balance out to 15. After a little while, it would balance itself out and uh, you'll be able to see this on the slush pool. Now it takes a very, very long time to sh actually show here. Such a small hash rate will take a long time to show. And if you wanna get paid, it will take even longer to get paid. It might get you weeks or months, depends on the minimum payment of the specific pool. Now, let's do some uh, mining calculation to see how much we're making. So we having a 15 um, hash rate, giga hash rate. The watts are three watts, but hard to calculate, so small. So if we calculate that, the monthly is almost a dollar for Bitcoin. Now that we checked Bitcoin, let's check Bitcoin Cash Mining Calculator. We have 15 giga hashes on three watts of power and we're making a dollar 13 a day. That's not bad. Uh, considering the very small amount of power it consumes. So pretty easy. Download the software, register to a pool, change the setting to your own pool, start mining. That's it. And it's just gonna keep running. Don't forget you need a computer for that. Uh, that's running 24 seven. So you have to calculate those costs as well. Okay guys, as you can see, it's not so difficult to install it, but it might take a while for you to get paid because today, minimum payment on Bitcoin is pretty high because of the mining fees. So keep that in mind. Maybe that's why it's better to mine Bitcoin Cash on this because mining fees are very low and uh, you'll be able to get paid more often. So try to use a pool that accepts Bitcoin Cash 
and then set up the pool information to the CG miner so you can mine it on this. So uh, yeah, I left I left a link below if you want to grab one of those. If I would recommend it, um, I don't know. I think I will recommend it if you first time miner, you don't want to mine on GPUs, which is probably a better way to go. Um, but if you just want to mine, you know, Bitcoin or Bitcoin Cash, this is the one to go because it actually runs the Bitcoin mining script and uh, it's a cool little device and very easy to use so I will recommend it for someone who wants to start in actually mining Bitcoin and um, it's cool to play with so thank you guys so much for watching I'll leave a link below to uh, the forum post about this particular miner so you guys can discuss about you know how it works or where to buy it and uh, so I'll open a discussion about that see you guys in the next video and thank you bye bye